Here's the thing that really gets me, okay? For lunch, obviously you can pack a lunch, you can bring a lunch, which we'll be doing. If you'd like to have a hot lunch there, which like one of the days the lunch is a hot dog, it's $5 for a fucking hot dog. Like, <laughs> what, what are we? At the stadium? We're at the Bronx now? Like, five fucking bucks for a hot dog? So in theory, if you had a hot dog, okay, you had a pack of hot dogs. I don't know. What is a pack of eight hot dogs? $4? Okay, pack of eight hot dogs. This damn school is making 36 bucks on a pack of hot dogs. We're paying, I won't say how much, but X amount to go to this school that, frankly, we're basically being forced to go to because apparently I make like a nickel more than we're allowed to to send to the, the, the public pre-K. Or it's just a I cannot believe there's even public and private pre-K. But they're trying to soak me for, for freaking $5 for a hot dog? I... Over my dead body, will I ever pay $5 for a hot dog? And then on top of that, they say, oh, by the way, milk is separate. It's a separate cost. If you'd like milk, you got to buy that. Oh, yeah, Heisler, this is, you got to buy that for the year. It's 70 bucks. I'll send her with a gallon of fucking milk before I pay 70 bucks. She's four. What is she going to do over the course of the whole year? Drink five gallons of milk? They're soaking me from milk. It's unbelievable. Like I was, I almost got into just into a space where I had to walk out of there. I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. So a hot dog is five bucks. Milk is 70 bucks for the year. 70 And God knows how many kids are in this school. I think it's like 300 or so, 400, like all told. My God. And then, you know, they're talking about how they built a wing on this place because they got $8 million a couple of years ago. I'm thinking to myself, like, you're, yeah, pay, you're making me pay for milk. It's the Oscar. It's the Oscar Mayer wing. It's like, yes, it's sponsored by Crowley and Oscar Mayer. I mean, this is unbelievable. So that's how I feel as I drop her off at school tomorrow. And if the school asks me for one cent, I swear to God, I'll put her back in the car. We're driving out of there. It's unbelievable. All the money we're paying for this. You boys can't flow to milk. It's it's. Unbelievable. Like, it is just the peak of, hey, we've got you by the balls, and now we're going to just do everything possible to squeeze another cent out of you. So, as some have pointed out in here, yes, I absolutely am going to be packing her lunch every day. Okay. And also, hey, we're, I love we're Lucas, idea. Lunch too. Lucas says, sell them for $2 a piece. I should. I should show up with a hot dog truck outside the dance floor. Hey, kids. <laughs> <laughs> Two bucks. We're gonna undercut these boys at the door. Okay, and I'm still making a hundred percent profit off the damn things. It is unbelievable. I mean, I'd hate to see if they ever had like some kind of a real lunch, like if they had like a chicken thing. My God, I'd be paying a second mortgage for it. Unbelievable, disgraceful situation. I listen. I, I know that we went through a lot of interesting and insightful NFL talk and analysis today on the show and the the. 75 minutes or so that we've been on together. No. I I hope that whoever tuned into the program for the last five minutes, like th- this would be like, this is, this is what I would put out to the world about this show. Like, this is how I would sell the show. I, we might have to clip was, it. We might have to was, clip it and put it out there. Yeah. This, this is what the people need. I'm with you. Hey, listen, we want to clip that and put it out. That's fine. I didn't yeah. name the I didn't name the school, so I don't feel too bad about right. it. Right. Or just, you know, if 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 you know Hunter and the rest of the staff are cool with it, maybe the, the tagline for this episode is five dollars for a fucking hot dog. And then it's unbelievable. Blow up. Like if you paid five dollars for a hot dog at, at at like Wrigley Field, you'd be like, okay, it's Wrigley Field. I get it. I'm overpaying, but fine. For a Freaking hot dog at the school. I, I just, I couldn't get over that. I was floored. I, at first, I thought they meant $5 for like the whole week. Like, that's what you're going to pay for lunch. Right. I'm like, all right, fair enough. And then they're like, no, no, no. That's just like Thursday. I was like, I'm sorry, what now? <laughs> like, I literally, I, so I've thought about this, but I think my wife would actually file for divorce. I thought about sending Maisie to school with an eight pack of hot dogs every single day. <laughs> and just being like, I don't care. Hand them out. I, I doesn't matter. Eat them all. Do whatever the hell you want with them. I want that school to know 
I paid eight. I paid less for eight hot dogs and for your one. I am I am vehemently opposed to it. Look, I digress. We can't go any further. But yes, what is happening is a travesty. And if you're out there and you're hearing this and you're thinking to myself, yeah, you know, my, you know, we're getting screwed too. Pack a lunch, tell these schools to jam it. That is insane. That is insane. I don't care. I, if I ever make a, a, a million dollars a year, which Lord knows once I win a lottery, yeah, that ain't happening, I would still not pay $5 for that hot dog just out of principle. A disgrace. I, I, we've we've had enough. That's how I, I, I mean, I I can't top that. It's a hundred percent true, and schools know it. And someone finally had the balls to stand up to them. So how much are they done. laughing as they're like they're writing this down on the on the slideshow? They're showing all the parents. They're like, they're oh, like in a board this. meeting. It's like all right, what is, what, these dumb sons of bitches are going to pay five bucks. Like you know, they were all like, do you think? Like and you know, at some point the conversation was had like, could we get six out of them? Like, nah, five's a nice, nice, like, even crisp, you know, it's a, it's a dollar bill denomination. Like, we're good. We're I'll, good. I'll, I'll end it on this, because this reminds me of, of, a, of a great Jim Gaffigan line from years ago, where he's talking about, like, the marketing meeting for, for bottled water. He's like, you think there's, like, a marketing meeting in France where some guy's at the top of a board meeting and smoking a cigarette and goes, this, how dumb do I think the Americans are? I bet we could sell these idiots water. Pierre, the, the Americans are dumb, but they're they're not gonna pay for water. <laughs> oh yes, they will. <laughs> we'll just tell them that the water was bottled in France. <laughs> it's so true. So true. It's so true. It's like I could just turn on the sink, uh, but why do that when I can buy a twenty-four pack from Poland Spring for now adjusted for inflation for ninety-seven dollars? Um, which, by the way, like, uh, that's the last thing. The school. My God, have you not seen what it costs to buy groceries? I bought a thing of peanut butter the other day. They basically had to like, they, they held me up and, and patted down my pockets. So like you got 28 bucks? Cause that's what Skippy costs now. And now I gotta go to the school, $5 for a hot dog. I mean, when they when they collect that money, do they put on like a little mask and, and put like the, you know, the, the fake handgun underneath the, the shirt? Right? Is it a holdup? Do they, do they apologize when they take the money? I, they will we'll never know because they will never get it. 